East Lansing is a small town, but we are right on the edge of Michigan State University, which is the first agricultural college. Um, there are a lot of sports and activities and art opportunities in our small town that uh, are not necessarily available to other small towns, thanks to MSU. The city of East Lansing is the only city in Michigan that has the public art ordinance. There are other communities across the United States that do. I believe New York does, there's someone in California that does, but we're it's pretty exclusive to us right now in our area in the Midwest. The public art ordinance, Ordinance 1339, is uh, in place so that when developers come in, they have to set aside a certain dollar amount, 1% up to $25,000 of their construction development budget to art. And they can either install art on site in many different forms, or they can donate the required dollar amount to the public art fund. And then the public art fund is kind of a savings account for the city to spend on art. There was a lot of resistance from developers, from community members, but ultimately there was people enjoyed the idea of having more art opportunities in the community. There is a small opportunity in the ordinance for architecture to be the art installation. Bertram Hills is a retirement community that was established in the early 1970s. In the fall of 2021, we we're going to open its recent expansion that fell under the East Lansing ordinance that required $25,000 worth of art. Bertram formulated an art committee and went through a selection process of the art, which generated excitement with the residents, which resulted in donations and contributions that now has art valued at over $50,000.